Hi, I'm Garrett Tao with AM Solar. This week we worked on an interesting project. This is an Airstream Globetrotter 2022. It came with a factory solar charging system that included two ZAMP 90 watt solar panels and a Victron 150 35 blue solar charge controller. The blue solar charge controllers don't have Bluetooth, so it's only the smart solar charge controllers that do. And this customer wanted to upgrade their system. So we added more solar, routed some more solar cables, and added a Victron BMV 712 battery monitor. I'll show you what we did. So up on the roof, you can see the original two Zamp 90 watt long solar panels. We have rerouted their wire harnesses, added new wire harnesses, and routed them to a combiner box that sits under this panel. And this is one of the four Noir 100 watt solar panels. We have them all connected in parallel going to a combiner box right under here. And it's nice, these panels, they have the recessed area behind them that allows you to install a combiner box hidden underneath one of the panels. So the factory wiring that came with those two 90 watt panels was only eight gauge, and that's not thick enough for running 580 watts of solar. So we needed to replace that with a separate run of cable that goes right from here where the combiner box sits on the roof right there it's just behind this this cabinet here there's a run that goes straight down and that's using four gauge duplex cable that goes to the new charge controller so down here under the bed we have the new 50 amp solar charge controller and we also did a battery monitoring system in here so we have the shunt for the battery monitor in here with the negatives from the battery box rerouted to this and the shunt comes with a display head unit that we use to replace the original um, MPPT control that was installed with the factory install. So the factory MPPT control display used to be right here and that's, that's a device you use when you don't have Bluetooth on your charge controller. It's a little bit more cumbersome to use than the Bluetooth on your phone. So we frequently replace that with uh, just a Bluetooth capable charge controller. And it just so happens that the BMV712 head unit uh, has the same form factor as the MPPT control. So we were able to fill that hole with the BMV712 uh, unit. And right now it's showing the battery bank voltage of 13.3, which is what you'd expect for lithium batteries. And that's the install. This is something we do all the time. If you want this done on your rig, let us know, amsolar.com.